in the record. We are made to live together because of the interrelated structure of reality. Well, this is the example of how people of different races, different faiths, different religions, they can sing together, they can be inspired together. I mean, there's nothing that gives more hope than the younger generation. And we had them from four years old to, to 18, 19, and it's not Dr. King, we've said enough about his memory. We have to keep his vision moving into the next generation. All right, I'm the Reverend Dr. Beth Braxton. And what it means to me to have all of these people in our congregation, it's a, it's a little touch of God's kingdom where love and peace and justice come together. Yeah, it's, it's the diversity uh, identified. I mean, I've never seen this much diversity in one place, particularly race, religion, you name it. It was very nice. My name is Andra Bayless. I'm the coordinator of this Dr. Martin Luther King commemorative event that is actually being held three days after the date of his assassination. Uh, and so instead of commemorating his birth, we're commemorating his assassination. He lost his life. He gave the ultimate price, you know, for us, for all of us, people of different religions, people with different uh, uh, races. Uh, uh, diversity is what he uh, is all about, and that's what America is about, and that's what he wanted for the world. Absolutely, as uh, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tells us, he's created us as nations and tribes so that we may get to know one another. The Interfaith Council, this MLK uh, celebration is all about getting to know one another as people of all faiths and backgrounds, love, harmony, and respect. What's your God and country. State your name and where's your troop from? Uh, so Rizwan Jaka, I'm the chair of the board of the All Dulles Area Muslim Society Adam Center. We have over 900 scouts and over 20 Eagle Scouts. And we are uh, blessed to work with Masjid Muhammad and the Interfaith Council. It doesn't it show that it's a very important event today because in this event you saw the globe. You saw a variety of religions from around the world that started from around the world and they're all here now in America. And so this is who we are. Not just who we are as a nation, as a country, America, but, but human beings around the world. And listen, look, God said he created us from sounding clay. We heard these sounds of harmony from different religions, different nationalities, different ethnicities, different races, and it sounds so beautiful. What's your name? My name is Mikhail Martinez Jaca. What does getting this award mean and what does it call you to do? Uh, to me, this represents all the hard work uh, put in by the community uh, under the cause for uh, uh, uplifting African-American history in Loudoun County and the country. And uh, it's, uh, it's just a reminder that we need to keep working. We need to uh, keep working forward to, for that beloved community that Dr. King wanted, and we need to continue on the journey to freedom for all people. Talk about that. This, this movement, the interfaith movement, had better be the future. If it's not the future, we're all in a lot of trouble. I love these events. I hope, wish more people would come out for them. Too much preaching to the choir. But whenever I go, I'm inspired. State your name. My name is Daniel Spiro, S-P-I-R-O. I'm the president of the Jewish Islamic Dialogue Society of Washington. I think it's critically important to give people exposure to opportunities and ideas and to people. Sometimes our greatest fear is about what we don't know. And if we don't know anybody who's different, we continue to hold unnecessary fears and concerns. Yeah, so I'm Rowan. I'm the, the Palestinian co-director of New Story Leadership, and we bring emerging leaders from Palestine and Israel to Washington, D.C. every summer, and we challenge the narrative and the story that's been occupying Palestinians and Israelis for centuries, which is a story of war and conflict. We give them an opportunity to get out of that uh, region and to really start thinking about a new story and a new vision for reconciliation in the Middle East. Thank you.